Yeah, that's it. Damn it, Balin told me these things were extinct. Extinct? You thought they were extinct and let us bet anyway? No, I just... well... yeah, basically. Well, all's well that ends well. It's a miracle! We've traveled to an entirely different world, and this is what qualifies as a miracle to you? Damn, I thought we got them all, but it looks like we missed one. You there, hand over that clover if you know what's good for you. Huh? Who the heck are you? We found this fair and square. If anyone else finds a clover, we lose our bet. If you won't hand it over, we'll take it by force. Are you serious? Oh wow, okay. Bring it on. Go get him! <laughs> okay, hold on. Oh, they're burning me. Oh, Jesus. They got wrecked. This reminds me of our training. I only remember getting beat up. Wow, they got super wrecked. <laughs> they Why did. Why did they just attack us like that? And what did they mean about a bet? Wait a minute. Do you know something? Best not to talk out here. Let's go back to Balin's. Yes. Now we get to hear an embarrassing story about Alvin. This is why I hate gambling. He pissed his pants when he was a kid. <laughs> That's cool. We found a light leaf clover. Uh, I wish there was an easier way to go to the apartment. There it is. Ah, oh, dude. I don't think. Yeah, I think I caught it on camera. I bought like a shit ton of items and uh weapons. Let's bring the light leaf. And then. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bring light leaf clover. Yeah, and I bought a. Oh fuck. Just an ass ton of weapons and armor. Like, better ones. Again, it kind of sucks that... Yeah, and I actually gone broke 100,000 gold. But, uh... It sucks that the Devil's Beast weapons aren't powerful. When you buy them... When you buy weapons from the store. It, kinda, it really does suck. Left. Yeah, I always get confused on where the elevator is. I always go to my right. Holy, I can't believe you actually found a light leaf clover. If we'd have bet money, you'd have made a killing. All right, make with the embarrassing stories. Oh well, a bet's a bet. <sighs> Which one are you going to tell them? Let's make it the one about this very clover. When Alvin was five years old, he wanted to do something for Aunt Leticia's, for his mother's birthday. He came up with the idea of giving her a crown made entirely out of light leaf clovers. Sounds like that could be difficult. Right. Even back then, they were quite hard to find. So little Alvin thought long and hard about what to do. After a lot of thought, he came up with the idea of painting regular clovers the color of light leaf clovers. That's brilliant! Is it? He gave it to Leticia before the paint was dry, and she ended up getting it all over her hair. Alvin was even more surprised at this than Leticia was, and he started bawling his eyes out. <laughs> out of habit, he buried his face in her hair as he tried to apologize, and ended up getting paint all over his face, too. The end. <laughs> That's so cute! That was a wonderful story. You really loved your mother, didn't you, Alvin? I'll get you for this, Balin. <laughs> oh, talking about Leticia has put me in the mood for one of her peach pies. Oh, they were absolute perfection. I'd give anything for one more bite, but unfortunately, it's not to be. Balin, you hang on to those memories. She may never have made it back to Olympias, but at least we can keep her memory alive. Even if you asked me to, I could never forget about her. Or about you, naturally. I'm glad I made it back. So wait, what happened to his mother? Who the fuck is that laying in bed? I, I, what? 
So she didn't make it back to Olympus. Maybe I don't. I don't know. I I really don't know. That really, huh? Confuzzled. But anyways, um, now we got that out of the way. Let's go fight this monster. So this is weak against I'm so hungry, water. I can't go on. Jude, make me something. Yes, Leia. Hmm. I don't know if this is going to be a tough battle or not. I mean, Volt was actually pretty fucking strong. Where to go? Where to go? Where did I go? Okay, high elevation. Hold on. When when does it fade out? Fuck. Oh no, I'm lost. Dimensional fist. Ah oh, fuck. There's like no upstairs and shit. Like I'm pretty sure there is. No. Okay. I am confused. I honestly, I, didn't I just, didn't I just go there? What the fuck? Okay, where's the other fucking? Down there. All right. To your right. I mean, that's the only way. In here. There we go. This is where it is. Oh, itchy. Alright. I really do hope this is the right way. It's not. Maybe it's at 13. Floor 13? Maybe floor 12? Uh, I don't I don't know. It's in this area, I know it. Is this it? I should have saved. Damn it, the most advanced Byrix weapons ever made and they can't blah blah blah. Does that monster even have a sword on its back? Can you tell me what that thing is? Beats the hell out of me, it's just attacked out of nowhere. We tried to fight it with our new Spyrix weapons designed to repel Muse, but they did nothing. We'll hold it off as long as we can and leave a lady to fend for herself? That's madness! Right, because picking a fight with an indestructible monster is the very height of sanity. Oh fuck, Rowan did have water. Right. Oh shit, it's bad. Um, guys, he looks pretty angry. He totally... It has quite the conviction. Wow, he's resist- damn, okay. No, that is not conviction. It's merely hanging on to the bloodlust of war. We can only oh my god. By ending its misery. That pissed Oh yeah, freaking she has Undine, I forgot about that. Oh my god! Ah, fuck, I almost had it. Oh shit. Over here. Go, Tipo! Sharing is caring. Dude, 
not what I wanted to do, but whatever. Block! This guy isn't as annoying. What the hell is going on? Oh shit! Oh, what the fuck? The stupid camera, I thought it was going for them. I was holding X, come on. Oh, Jesus. Good evasion, Leia. Oh, Jesus. Almost there. There we go. Was really close. Yes. I need more. All right, so now we got all weapons from all the devil's beasts. Sweet. I can't believe you beat that thing, man. We good. That's why. An electrifying performance, wouldn't you say? Oh yes, I was positively shocked. Rowan trying to flirt. All that electricity must have scrambled their brains. <laughs> Is that really possible? That would make sense. 
forgive me, just releasing a little tension. I really am impressed that you were able to defeat such a powerful monster without using Spyrix. Oh, that was nothing. My only fear was that it wouldn't stick around long enough for us to deliver the finishing blow. I was afraid it might... Bolt! Oh my god. <coughs> now I'm the one who's shocked. <laughs> Perhaps the lightning really has affected Rowan's judgment. I think that hit harder than the monster. All that hard work and now we're coming off like a bunch of idiots. Putting Rowan down. Assholes. <laughs> All right. Um, let's get strength and let's get some of that dexterity. Mila, what do you have? What do I need you? Tell the and let's actually right here. So that that teep. Oh, I don't have it connected yet. Whatever. Agility 2. Alright. Alright, now, eventless. Uh, Devil's Beast. The party received more information to the storyteller regarding who grows stronger, blah, 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 blah. Alright, so now we actually. What happened? That was the last of them. We've eradicated all of the extant Devil's Beasts. Indeed. The last remnants of the Battle of Fezabel. After 20 years. I'm glad we were finally able to put them to rest. And since we got the Devil's Arms, it was a win-win! We got a twofer! They sure weren't easy to find, though. I guess the Devils were in the details. Oh, Here. God. Seriously? Alvin? What's wrong? It's probably nothing, but don't these weapons seem a bit strange to you? In what way? I don't know quite how to put it, but... They feel like they're not as impressive as they should be. Now that you mention it... These are weapons not forged by men, but born from beasts. They may have special properties. Maybe the old man who told us about the Devil's Beast knows something. That's true. We can head back to Sapstrath Seahaven to see him. Perhaps he can tell us more about these Devil's Arms. Wow. Oh, see, Alvin just really spoke my mind. Holy shit, it's like, these Devil's Beasts aren't really as, or weapons aren't really as impressive as, as they should be. Um, let's go to the equipment. Who, I think it was for Rowan. Yeah, it was. And that thing is weak as fuck. Uh, yeah, again, it doesn't seem as impressive. Look at these things. Huh, really, really interesting. So now that we actually finished all the Devil's Beasts, um, I actually really want to say thank you to... I think I think the name is like Liz or something. Told me she or he told me about this thing, uh, the Devil's Beast side quest. Like if I finish it, there will be in, like a hidden a hidden boss or an extra boss. So I was like, oh, that sounds interesting. I think I'm gonna do it. So yeah, now we're actually on the road of doing this shit. This is great. Wow! Right off the bat, you want to fight me, you fucking prick. <laughs> 